Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Bob Shaw. Welcome to Friday. It is nine minutes past the hour and looking at a morning here on the high desert that really isn't too bad. Uh, we've had a few clouds that have pushed out of the area, leaving us under somewhat clearer skies this morning. Consequently, our morning commutes are going to be uh, okay. Well, the Lapine has now soured on us a little bit. There's some snow that has fallen through there. You still have to carry chains or traction tires around Central Oregon and some areas, the upper elevations, you may find yourself using them, especially if you're headed across the Cascades. We'll get a look at that here in a moment. Uh, looking at some storm activity through the central portion of our nation from uh, northern Texas all the way up into Nebraska. Uh, we are looking at some storm activity pushing into the northwest. And it, while it may be a little bit on the spotty side through the course of the day, it is indeed going to close in on us and give us all a shot at some uh, snow showers. Now, for the day ahead, we're looking at some mixed showers. The first places that are going to sock in, and that's already becoming evident, will be the upper elevations to our south. By dinner time, we're all looking at a chance of some scattered snow showers and will retain that uh, about a 40% chance of snow overnight tonight. So don't be surprised if you get up tomorrow morning, Saturday morning, and it's nice and slick outside. Now that'll break. This whole thing will break a little bit on Saturday, but by the time we get into Saturday night, it closes in again, and we'll have a very good chance of some mixed showers going into Sunday morning. This will stay with us a little bit on Sunday morning into Sunday during the day. It'll turn to rain showers, and then we'll live with this chance of showers coming and going for the next several days. For right now, low 20s to low 30s to get the morning underway. We are not looking at a great deal of wind. This southerly flow stays with us. It'll only pick up to about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So it's not a huge wind event, but we are looking for these mixed showers. Highs today in Jefferson and Wasco County will be in the low to mid 40s. In uh, Jefferson, excuse me, in Crook County, mid 30s to low 40s. So a little bit cooler through there. And in Deschutes County mid 30s to low 40s as well. So it's closing in on us gang. We are going to see uh, something a little more like a wintry weekend here in Central Oregon. Now the nice thing is once we get out of the weekend, in fact beginning about Sunday, we'll see highs, daytime highs rising into the mid 40s. Consequently our chance of showers will be turning to rain showers. Overnight we'll be down to freezing and a little bit below. So our chance of showers will be in the form of snow showers. You can plan on this staying with us for the next several days. We don't really get a much of a break in this until we get toward the end of next week.